one evil card here. Coming at you with a quick vlog slash haul video. Um, but first and foremost, I want to wish my son happy birthday. He turns 14 today. So cool. Uh, big day for him. Secondly, I wanted to discuss BotCon. Um, I had plans to go to BotCon this year. It would have been very easy for me. It would set the Disney World Resort, which I have timeshares. So accommodations would have been free, basically. And airfare would have been minimal if I flew out of Minneapolis at that time. I think it would have cost me about 200 bucks return. But the organizers at BotCon probably didn't consider that us Canadians, our children, have school until the end of June. And the weekend of BotCon, both my kids have their grads. Uh, one on Wednesday and one on the Friday. So my priority is with my kids and that's where I want to be. So BotCon 2010, you're out. However, I will be going to TFCon in Toronto in July and that's what I wanted to tell you guys so if anybody any of my subscribers or anyone viewing this is attending TFCon in Toronto on July 17th and 18th message me and we can definitely uh, hook up and have a little meet and greet I will be taking some members of Cybertron.ca with me as well as a couple of friends I know from the TFW. And hopefully my buddy Seaspray can make it out as well. Now on to my haul. Uh, it's been a pretty good week. I was able to get uh, some more Cybertron figures as well as some more Henkai figures. So it gets me that much closer to completing both lines. Um, first, went to a local comic shop found a couple Cybertron Deluxes that I didn't have so I picked them up starting off with Long Rack and I also got Snarl then I believe on Monday I went and I had lunch with Clint Seaspray717 and I took him to another local toy shop which deals primarily with um, loose vintage action figures and uh, memorabilia uh, however they do have some ink package stuff and there I grabbed my first Beast Wars Transmetal figure this one is Tarantulas got a really good deal on him and while I was with the uh, Sea Spray we did some more trading, but I'll get to that in a bit. In the mail, I got some Henkes. First one being Ramjet. Second one was Sunstreaker. Third one was Bumblebee. And the last one is the exclusive Skywarp. So my Seeker set for the Henkai series is now complete and I'm pretty stoked about that. Also, from a member of the Cybertron.ca forums, I picked up this guy for my Cybertron set. Mitten Sealed Box Soundwave. I'll probably do a review on him soon. So, on to my visit with Sea Spray. He was nice enough to give me a gift and introduce me to my second and third ever RID figures. Got me Hightower as well as Wedge. So now I'm on the hunt for the other two to complete the combiner. Also, we traded and he got me 
some more Cybertron figures that I needed. Run amok. Blur. And Exilion. And if that wasn't enough, he traded me something that I needed for the longest time. And that is this bad boy. I've got the Henke Skywarp, but the classic Skywarp is just as nice, if not better. But I really needed the Ultra Magnus. I have the City Commander add on set from Fans Project, but I didn't have a classic Ultra Magnus to put it together. And now I do. Thanks a lot, Clint. I really appreciate that. Uh, I know uh, this must have been a hard set to part with, and thanks, man. You're awesome. And that about sums up my haul for this go round. Um, like I said, if you're going to TFCon 2010 in Toronto, July 17th and 18th, message me and uh, we'll exchange info and we can definitely uh, meet up um, Clint if you're watching we definitely have to go together let me know Evil Carl